again, a very thin coat. Put the liquid clear. Just blob it about lightly. And then if you blob it about like that, you can just put it on that a little bit quicker because it spreads easier rather than just filling up your brush and putting it all in one place. It's a lot easier to just do that. Little circles. Yeah, once a year, sister. <laughs> oh, is that your ear hair? <laughs> oh, getting old's no fun, is it, really? I'm getting hair in places I never thought I'd get it. And I've got greys coming through. Oh, it's terrible. I can smell. I can smell like a really nice paint, but I don't know where it's coming from. Some paints smell nice. I am a little bit weird, but there we go. One of the nicest things I like, like if, when you're painting decorating, is this smell of wood filler. I don't get high on it or anything, but um, it has got a really nice smell. The stuff that goes, you mix together and it goes off really fast. I like aerosol cans, I like the smell of them, but they're obviously bad for you. I don't sit there sniffing them, but I do like the smell of them. Right, okay. What am I talking about? <laughs> what am I talking about? Right, let's go into some colour. Um, we've got this brush here. Let's start with, what's that? A bit of tissue. Right, let's start with some phthalo blue. Okay. And I want to put... A, load all around the middle just there a lot of phalo a lot of phalo bring that right down this is just phalo blue just a small amount on the brush and you can blend it. I'm leaving a bit at the top because I want to put some Prussian blue around there and bring this right down Again, I can put some colour wherever I want it really with the Prussian blue. So you've got the blue on there. There we go. Um, I can't understand what that says there. Um, that's a shame. Can anyone translate that for me? Or Duncan, you know, a bit of, is it French or something? Um, can I translate it? Oh, I can't. I don't know how to translate. I think I did it before. I thought I held it and it translated, but... All right, a bit of Prussian blue up here. Okay, here we go. Just sort of doing that in a semi-circle motion. A bit here and there, down there, darken some of that up. Right, okay, now... Let's add some white. I want to make a nice little sky, so we're gonna go. Let's just just put a bit here. There's a bit there. I blend this out. I want to lighten up the sky quite a bit. I, want, I don't want it too dark. I want a bit of white sort of everywhere. Prussian blue. You know what you are making? Wants to know what you're making. Oh, oh. Um, tell him to stick around. Uh, we're going to do a blue scene, basically. Um, yeah, um, thanks for translating that. That you are making him was the trans. Oh, okay. Oh, it's not French. Oh, sorry. I'm so rubbish, aren't I? Just hold the screen over the comment not. I said translate. Okay, let's try that. Because I thought I did it. Um, No, it's not doing it for me, I don't know why. This is so relaxing, good. That's my whole point of doing this. Okay, now we're just gonna blend this out. I want the skylight, I don't want all, I wanna, see, I wanna get all of it. I wanna make bright areas. 
low areas. I can't see much over there because of that glare. I wish there was a way to get rid of that glare, but then I need the lights on. I will say it, and you're probably bored of me saying that, but it does kind of annoy me. Right, we'll go somewhere about there. Just bring that up, and I want it more brighter. So I'm just gonna add some white, nearly add this black there. Some more white to this area. carefully very carefully a little bit more just building up really until I'm until whatever I kind of want I have a bit that sort of goes all the way over there okay and then lightly blend two hairs and some air Yeah, it's getting a little bright spot there now. How many likes have we got? Did we make it? Oh, we're at 7,000. 7,000? 7,000? Yes. Oh, it's Spanish. Okay. Duncan, I just read your comment. I thought you meant the painting. I was like, how does this look? But there you go. Right, very lightly go over that. Let's see if we can do it. Let's see if we can put a little moon bit of finger painting. I want to get into that bright white there. Just put a little moon there. It's quite hard because it's wet on wet but bear with me I will get it. Something like that. And I'm going to blend that out so it doesn't have to be perfectly perfectly straight or round. Uh, no, it's the moon. Yeah, that looks like the moon behind. Yes, yes. Right, very gently. I want to go up. Just blending that out. I want a very faint moon. There we go. Just a very glowy moon. Don't touch it too much. That's it. It's just a little faint moon. That's it. That's all I wanted. Um, how about some stars in the sky? What do you reckon? Some stars. I think I've blended this out. I can't see. It's not good if I can't see. I've really got to look into some different light, I think. Maybe, maybe some distant light. Okay, so let's do some stars. So I've got some liquid white over here somewhere. 30 people in here. The number's gone down. We need to share. We need to do something. Okay, so... Let's just go a little bit of magic white, which is a thinner oil based paint, and I'm mixing it with this is my flicking brush. Okay, let's just see what this gives us just some stars here and there. Oh, that's a nice one. Yes, we've got stars. That's pretty cool, I like it. Now I've got a dirty finger. Perhaps you haven't seen you do stars. Oh, there you go, there's a little... You can't see them very well, I'm so sorry that you can't see them very well because of the glare, but I will show you at the end. I don't know, it looks terrible on my iPad, but it looks so different here. Well, right, anyway, let's, uh, what should we do? Some distant mountains. Bit of white, let's clean that palette off first. I'll the knife off. I don't know what it looks like on your uh, phones or whatever you're watching on, but um, it's so different. It looks, it looks awful on there, but... Well, okay, I'm going to make a little pale blue colour. Let's have a touch of the dark. Touch of this up here. A grey blue. Just a touch darker. Something like that. Touch darker. Bit more blue. Yeah, something like that, that's fine. Okay, I'm going to cut across here. 
let's just see what this looks like, something like that. I'm just going to do a few distant, distant mountains just around here. These are very distant, don't need too much in there, just a little bit more dark right now. Just a bit more, that's it there. Can see it fine, oh good, oh good, thank you. Uh, let's, do, let's have another one that goes up here. So this is just a couple of distant mountains. Maybe there's one over there. We're gonna get the brush and we're gonna pull that down. Just pull that color down. Remember these are very distant. Can you see? Yes, you can see. Okay, we're gonna pull that down there. This down there. We're just gonna. Amy Joe, thank you so much. It really is appreciated. It's marvelous how you mix your paints to every color possible. Yeah, the basic paints. Thank you so much for that gift. We've got seven hand hearts tonight. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. I'll just put a little bit of a highlight on them. Thanks, everyone. So a little bit of a glow. I'll probably use the fan brush for this. Um, I've got the white sort of, let's go into that white, still keeping a little bit of blue on there. I just want to create the little, the littlest shape on the mountains. A little bit of bright from that moon coming down. There's a bit here as well. Too much, maybe there's just a little bit over there. I'm gonna have some trees there, so I'm not really fussed too much here. And then we're gonna pull this down. Thank you so much for them gifts, really appreciate it. Just gently shake them mountains around. There we go, little distant moonlit mountains. Very, very distant. Right, let's get some black. Just some black. I can probably mix in these blues together as well to use it up. Um, right, I'm back. Hold on. I don't think the uh, thing's charging. Hold on. There we go. Cool, my battery is nearly flat on my iPhone. There we go. Back again. Right, let's just, let's just knock all this colour up together. I've got, you see all this colour on here? Let's just get all that, mix all that together. It's going to be like a dark blacky blue colour. That's a good way to use up the paint. There we go. Lots of paint. Just going to have a little bit of black. How, who's checked out the website yet? If you haven't, please do. Please do. There we go. Nice dark colour. Plenty of. Okay. Going with the fan brush. And I want to create another sort of plane that lives around here. So let's just let's just mark it out sort of where we want to go. Maybe there's a dip there. We just put some little things there. Okay, and somewhere around here we'll have we'll have all this dark, a little bit of land. Something like that. Okay. Now I want to make some trees, so we're gonna probably go over this over these mountains. We can have some nice trees here. There's one that lives there. And this is sort of silhouette stuff, so it's gonna be dark and just black. It's a very simple painting like the other one really. 
but effective, simple but effective. I'm looking forward to doing the water. I really am. It looks like something out of a fan out of a fantasy. Oh, great, Anna. How you doing, Anna? Nice to see you here. Love some little ones here. Lunch. Love some little bushes there. Just some little bushes. Uh, let's have some big ones over here. Probably won't see much of these mountains, but... See? Big old tree. They were distant mountains. So we can see some just through. And we'll put this one here. I'm looking forward to doing the water. Water. I tried to say it properly. Go here. Like maybe we should have a little break there so you can just see some of that mountain colour through there. Something like so. Right now let's have some fun with the water. Let's get this kind of straight here. I need to put um, some white in here. Now, this is going to be fun. Um, I want more sort of... Yeah, I'm going to lighten that up. I'm going to lighten the water up and then do reflections of the trees, hopefully. So, I need to put some white in the water. Let's just go something like this. Probably a bit more light around this area than over here. We still want some light there to show that it's water, but more bright over here. Let's have this coming right down. I'm gonna have to bring that forward in a bit, but pull that across there. Right, we're gonna pull that across. I need to move this. He did this in like a solid 20 minutes. Wow, is that all it's taken? Okay, yeah, I'm gonna be finished doing this well. <laughs> okay, let's just pull this here on like this. Uh, lift that up. Careful, 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 careful. Okay, I need to lock that in position. Something like that. Okay, so, not with that brush. I'll clean off my brush a little bit. See if I'm, can I take some of that glare off for you? Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna pull this down. Like that. Let's just make this water now, look. See, we've got that sort of glow coming from. So we've got a nice little dark area down here. Well, now we can do, look at that sheen on the water, isn't that amazing? I, I'm trying, how can I get rid of that glare? Uh, right, now, now watch. Uh, take the fan brush, the black fan brush. And we're gonna do, do some reflections here. So we wanna sort of make these sort of trees, just mirror them sort of images. Right 
something like that. Fill up this colour here. Are you enjoying the line? Right now, again, we need to uh, pull down and then pull across, and hopefully, we'll have uh, some nice water reflections. There we go, something like that. Can't see a thing over here. <laughs> okay, there we go. Straight down. And then look, this is so magical. Just pull that in, then there's your instant water. Instant water, awesome, says Duncan, thank you. Yes, it's uh, it's an amazing life. Oh, brilliant, thank you. It does feel like you're in fast forward though. <laughs> Am I am I painting fast tonight? Am I painting fast? Shove a little bit of um something here. Um, we'll do a little water line as well. We'll do a little water line. I've painted fast tonight, right? Because it's a very simple painting, so you know it's uh This is what I started really out doing, these kind of things and um, oh wow, that's beautiful, thank you. Um, love this painting, Richard Colton, amazing, thank you. This one is for sale, if you're interested, just let me know before it goes up on the website. And like I said, I've reduced so a lot of paintings on the website today, so go and check out a look, go and check out some there. I'm just putting a little water line in there. That is actually like a bluey sort of grey colour on. Love how much more confident you are in your painting now, it's fantastic. Thank you, Victor Ball, much appreciated. How are you? Nice to have you here. <laughs> He's got a bird coming around soon. <laughs> Duncan, no wish. <laughs> okay, just a few little, maybe a bit of liquid white. Just some very thin paint. There we go, just a bit more. I'm making a very, very thin paint. We just put some nice little... This is where you need to really keep this. You need to keep, you need to keep this straight. You can have it just as it is, you know, you don't need to put these on, but I like to put them on every now and again. It shows a little bit of water blend them out a little bit, just just a little swipe. Just so some little glistening bits in the water. Just a bit here and there. I had a crazy few weeks organising a hen do. Oh, nice one. And attending the wedding, so pleased to chill with you. Ah, oh, I bet that was cool. <laughs> I bet that was uh, if you're organising it, you know. With this moon here, we've got that sort of glare there. We can have a little sort of, let's just show you what you can do, like a little, look, just a little rippled effect with the moonlight. Just an extra little thing, you know? Bit of, a little bit more line. And you can brush that out, you could have left it out, was. We can just brush it out. Let's have something down here. I don't know what, but let's have something down here. I'm going to go in the fan brush. We'll just put some little bits of land in here. I'm like, well, coming right down to there, so you can just make out little bushes and stuff. There you go, just simple. Bit of the light colour, and we can just put a little bit of light here and there. down that bit. You see all them nice little grassy areas there you go. And we can put some nice little uh, things in. She was a beautiful bride and it was a fantastic time but need to decompress with you all. Oh yeah yeah I bet. 
uh, uh, Ashlyn. Ashlyn, how are you doing? Croquet Crinkles, how are you doing? With a new name. Is Matty Keen here? Oh, Matty Keen, how are you doing? Hello, I just had to remove to Big House Bar just from my room. Terrifying. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, do you know what? I had a massive spider at mine as well the other day. It was absolutely massive. I'm talking like the size of the bottom of a cup. Let's think of a name for this one, can we? Hi, Carla. Good, how are you? Yeah, good. Nice to see you here, Ashley. It really is. And Mazzy as, uh, as well. Duncan, are you still here? Or, or Mazzy, perhaps Mazzy, or someone would like to do a poll. This is the second painting tonight. Um, so I've done two in an hour, which ain't too bad, is it? Yeah, okay, either Duncan or whoever wants to do a poll, I'd really appreciate it. That'd be amazing. There we go. Just a few more little things up here. Just want to straighten. Where's the black one there? Black paint there. Just neaten up some of them there. I can put a few little highlights on the tree as well. I might do that. Midnight nipples. Oh, ripples. <laughs> Midnight Ripples, I'm so sorry. Midnight Ripples, <laughs> that's the one. Looking good, Carl says Ribberoo, thank you. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> My bad. Carl, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm getting told off now. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It did look like it though, it's because <laughs> It's because all this white here, I can't read it properly sometimes. You know what I'm like for pronouncing stuff. Right, okay. Uh, I'm going to just put a few little, while we're, while we're sort of waiting, I'm going to put a few little tiny, tiny, tiny bits of colour on these trees. So this is where you can have a silhouette or you can just, I mean, I don't want this bright, so let's make a colour greyish blue, bit of this, bit of that, bit of liquid white, just to thin the paint down. And that helps it stick on. There we go, look at that. There's some good names there. There's some good names, I can see them already. Maybe we'll just put a bit. You can just see. Just a bit around them where the moon is. That's catching a little bit up there. There we go. We could call the... <coughs> we could call the painting that. <laughs> I can't paint, shush. <laughs> There's a little bit of highlight, very good names, absolutely. Names, Silent Night, Moonlit Sky, Blue Tranquility. There's so many good names. So many good names. Again, I'm just putting the tiniest bit of highlight. Tiny, tiny. This one's a big one, so he's going to need a little bit here. I'm going to stick to this sort of side of it. A little bit here and there. I want to show you this one without the light. Yeah, that'll do. Nothing too drastic. Oh, maybe there's a few little. Um, there is. There's going to be a few little thing. <laughs> Name Midnight Nipples by Carl. <laughs> Let's go into this sort of dark colour here. Midnight Nipples. Can you imagine? I'm just going to go into this dark colour and make this very thin. Bob's having a laugh in the corner, he's laughing his end off. Brenda's like, oh, behave. Okay. Right, where am I fancying a few of these little... Just a few little ones there. Just 
just a few little colours difference. Yeah. That's just enough, I think. I think done too much. Just brings them ones alive a little bit more. Catching a little bit of light. We can put some little seed heads on the one. Um, okay, look. Okay, I have brought yarn to hopefully send you a little pushy, plushy curl. We should see how it goes. Oh, crochet crinkles, ashen. That's amazing. Thank you for the gift as well. Thank you for the heart. A little squizzle. It's going to be a little squizzle, is it? <laughs> right, we can put a few little seeds on these. Look, just a few little heads. These are tiny. Tiny, tiny, tiny. These big ones over here. Just see if we can just. That's better. Right, I'm going to show you guys in a minute without without all this glare on. Hopefully, you'll be able to see it a little bit a little bit better. Um, name the painting. It's up. I have. Oh no, I've read that bit already. That'd be amazing. That really would. Right, yes, yeah, so the poll's active, so yeah, there's some good names there, so let's go. Let's get a name for the painting. Who's gonna win the name tonight? Who's gonna win the painting name? I'm gonna sign this one off. Bit of bright red. I'm just going to sign it off in the usual place there. There we go. Right, two paintings, about six brushes, I think. One, two, three, four, five, seven brushes. Not bad. Not a bad clean up day tomorrow. Not bad at all. Looks like your painting state and it reminded me to start making it. Ah, oh, brilliant, thank you. This should be it actually looks like what it's supposed to. I'm sure it would, your stuff is brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. It's good to find a hobby in it that you like. I mean, I love art, so I never, you know, for years I didn't do anything. Loving the merch. <laughs> thank you, yeah. Mm. Yeah, there's all sorts of stuff on there. Well, a few people said to me a while ago, you know, that if I made cups and everything, you know, so I thought I'd just do it, so. Mm. Right then, I'm gonna clean my hands off a little bit. And, <laughs> I'm gonna clean my hands off a little bit and I'm gonna show you a, quick, a, a better look at this without the glare, hopefully. Gosh, look, I'm going home like a smurf tonight. I think I'm at the bottom of the packet of these and they've gone a bit dry. But I'll get there. Uh, actually, a little tip that I found out. Um, shampoo's pretty good to getting it off. Not as good as like, um, you know, thinners and stuff like that, but it is pretty cool. Please don't vote for Midnight Nipples, it's banter. Oh my gosh. Did you actually put it up there? That's like saying don't think of pink elephants. Two minutes left, right, we've got Moonlit Sky, Lover's Lake, Midnight ni midnight Ripples, D's not really there. <laughs> I know you're gonna vote for it, don't. Deepest Blue, okay, if Midnight Nipples wins, yeah, Midnight Ripples is gonna be. Blue Tranquility, Silent Night, Tranquil Dreams, Moonlight Lake, there we go, two minutes, under two minutes, left. I'm hoping my God, I'm hoping my goods arrive soon, looking forward to them. Yeah, I think mine took about seven to 10 days, I think, something like that. Right, I think, I think they come from another country. I think, I think it's, I think it's Germany, I'm not too sure. But you will get them. Right, hang on. Let's just show you this, and uh, we'll see. Over there. 
This is quite light actually for a dark painting. This is without really any lights on it. You can see the stars, right? Still got a bit of reflection on there, but there's not a lot I can do, see? No, I didn't go to art school. I started about a year. How long? When did I start? It is about coming up to a year and a half, I believe. Amy Jo, thank you for the hand heart. Really appreciate it. I like them distant mountains over there. Thank you so, so very much. See the reflections in the water. This is one that's going to look good when it's dried. What I'll do with this one, because it's got the liquid clear on, I'll, um, I always lacquer my paintings as well, so it'll seal that up, it'll stop it shining so much, but it is wet paint to be honest, so it shines more and you've got these big bright lights on. Love the star effect, thank you. Just a bit of light on the trees. Thank Fix the fixable. Will you add merch to the Christmas wish list? Christmas wish list. Add merch to Christmas wish list. Um, what, merch for me? Or the Christmas wish list? Oh, what do you mean like um, an Amazon Christmas wish list or something? I'm confused. Really lovely, Cole, thank you. Awesome painting, it looks amazing, thank you. Yeah, this one is for sale. If anyone's interested, you just let me know. Send me a message. Like all the others, you know. This one will be going up on the website soon. This was from the other night. I did this the other night. It's not yet up on the website. This is a... These are brilliant. Because even in the sort of dark, that's me standing in the shadow. Look, can you see? They still sort of brighten up. Looks really cool, thank you. Moonlight Moonlight Lake is the win, okay. Circle one is done. It is, isn't it? I love doing them. I'm gonna do a crimson one. From from you, yes. Like for people to buy me. My brain hurts. I can't think. Aston, I'm so sorry. I'm not understanding it. Oh Christmas mugs! Oh I see what you mean. So you know I'm a bit dense sometimes. I don't know, I haven't thought about that actually. Yeah. That's the other one tonight. Oh, it's so shiny down there, isn't it? Did that one and just before that one. There's a big boy there. I'm sorry, I put my Christmas wish just for someone. Buy... Oh, I see what you mean. Oh yeah, yeah, it's from uh, my website, so it's not from Amazon at all. So I don't think you can add it like that. I'm not too sure. There's a few more up there I've done recently. I've got no light at all on that. I need a bit of light. That's quite a nice one, isn't it? We got my first lightning strike over there. Um, no, it's not. Uh, it's, yeah, don't worry. <laughs> Yeah, if you click on the website, it, it literally, you order it from the website. It's not actually Amazon. But hopefully, I think I've cleared that up now. There's one I did the other night. It's on the side. And these were the Twin Towers. I ended up doing two of them because two people are interested. Now they're not interested, so I've got two of them. <laughs> they look so different, actually. I need a bit, bit more light on them. Yeah, that was the uh, Twin Towers sort of memorial thing. But yeah. Okay, so, uh, you know Mazzy Keen, look at this beautiful cat picture, drawing, beautiful. Right, okay, I've forgotten the winner now, I've forgotten the name of the painting now, I'm so sorry, I'm coming back, it's on a little tour. Um, these are cool, Kyle, thank you so much. Oh, I've missed it, yeah, I've done two, Jen, Jen, how are you? We've missed you, Jen. They're not there. <laughs> okay, right. I'm gonna name the painting. I am, I promise I'm gonna do it now. I'm chatting away like anything. I think I had my smarties before I come on live, so I'm a little bit hyper. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> sorry, I'm back, absolutely beautiful. Thank you, Mazzy. 
Um, all right, I've got to name the, name the painting. Let's have a look. The result was Moonlight Lake. Who picked that one? Moonlight Lake. Right, let's sign it off. Sign it off. Right, so I've um, signed it down the bottom there, obviously. These are really good canvas boards as well, these ones. Okay, so live on TikTok. And today's date is the 17th. Oh no, I forgot to change the number, didn't I? Damn. Uh, so in the video, it's going to say 212. I'll have to put a little lump over that. A little lump of writing. <laughs> Painting number 213, isn't it? Yeah, 213. Oh. First run with my own door set. I'm coming up there in a week. Saturday I'm coming up. Um, another for another another week. Uh, CM on the front. There's my signature. Uh, here is my name. And this one is called, gosh, I think it's Moonlight Lakes, isn't it? Moonlight Lake, yeah, Moonlight Lake. I've got a brain like a sieve. There we go, there you go, two paintings done tonight. Um, probably all over again. Yeah, probably all over again, hopefully, depending on the weather. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I am, I love it down that way, absolutely love it. It's very, very, very nice. Right, you're so talented, Matskeen. Yes, Matskeen is so talented. If you're not following, please follow already. Um, gosh, that's awesome, Cole. Oh, you like it? Good. Right, um, um, uh, who's uh, Weird Zaminka? How you doing? <laughs> A little wave there. Right, so there you go. There's two paintings. Jen, did you see the other one? I don't know if you if I show, showed you it when you was here or if I showed people when you weren't here. Um, let me know and I'll show you. If not, I shall go. The palette. That's the palette tonight for two paintings. Literally blues. Blues, um, whites, and that's it. So many talented people in this life. Yes, there is, including yourself. Make sure you go and follow Ashlyn as well. I'm looking forward to a little squizzle. <laughs> a little squizzle. That'd be nice. Carl, I can't. I named the painting tonight. Oh, June, well done. I missed the first, okay. Um, it is over here. It's a very basic one. Um, but I'm gonna show you guys. I did show, it's, uh, it's just a very basic sort of one way of looking up, basically. You can't see the light on it, it's just, just something different, having a play about really, you know? Interesting little one, right? So there we go. I'm sorry I'm putting on my Christmas wish list for someone's buying me. If the oh hang on. Um Oh do you like that one, Mazzy? It's different, isn't it? That one will catch the light definitely in which way you go. That one definitely catch the light. I'm gonna do some more of these, like I said. Definitely gonna do some more of these. Um, so looking forward to that and difficult maybe crimson next time make another I've done two I'm tired uh, what's the time half 11 yeah I've been live for nearly an hour and a half now so we got 11,000 likes tonight um, we got eight eight hand hearts thank you to everyone who sent them very much appreciated get some sleep mister you're the boss I'm doing it now <laughs> Love the effects on the first painting, it may be simple but beautiful. Yeah, very simple, yeah. I'm gonna experiment more with that as well. I've, tonight, basically, 
um, that one over there and this one is what I started out doing, you know, on TikTok. And I just wanted to go back to literally where I started. But things like this on my first one didn't look as good. I think that looks much better than just little things, you know. So there you go. Thank you for the gifts. Really appreciated. Hello, YouTube, says Jim Berry. Yeah, don't forget you can follow on YouTube. Everything, um, as you know, gets put up there. You can watch them back anytime. Uh, so happy to catch alive and see you all. Says uh, Croaky Crinkles. There you go. Once again, exactly. It's nice to go back and redo things and see what's improved. Absolutely, Mazzy. Yeah. Good night to all. There you go. There you go. And don't forget, come and take a look at the website. There you go. There's my Amazon wish list. You press that button, takes you straight there. Still going with that. If it, um, trying to get that going again. If anything purchased off the wish list, then leave your name on it and we're going to do a painting giveaway. I gave away three paintings last time. And you can email me right there that Bob and Brenda are very happy to reply. Right then. Good night, everyone. Hope you all have amazing sleep. And you too, Mazzy. Mazzy, I bet you have you just woke up. <laughs> You're a bit of a midnight owl, aren't you? I think I am too. Hello, YouTube community, says Tyler. Love you all, old Duncan, love you too. <laughs> well, I love to all of you. Thank you. I'm definitely going now. Let's just get a bit of a shot for here. Oh, yeah, I, I really didn't take much of a shot for the video. Hold on, let me just do that and then I'll go. Oh, thanks for a great stream. Richard, you're welcome, mate. Thank you. I am indeed, says Mazzy. Uh, uh, Amy, Joe, thank you so much for being here tonight and thank you for the gifts um, and liking and everything like that. Swoosh. There we go. <laughs> See you later, guys. Lots of love.